Hello guys, good morning. Happy first day of winter break for us anyways. I come downstairs here because I think Chase slept down here all night. Chase. Chase. Hey. Mm. <laughs> it's time to wake up. You sl it's 11 o'clock. You gonna wake up? No. <laughs> you need to. Why'd you sleep down here? Mm, you slept with Shaggers? Mm -hmm. He stayed with you all night? <clears throat> you need to, um, why don't you go hop in the shower because I'm going to make some eggs and hash for breakfast. Okay? Whatever. So, I needed to come down here also because we have some Christmas presents that we haven't wrapped yet. And, um, Andrew's going to be down here wrapping later. And there's a couple things down here for him that aren't wrapped. So, I need to, I'm actually just going to wrap them real quick. Oh, look at these guys. Any guesses what these are? It's that time of the year again when it starts to draw on Christmas. And that's it. Ah. 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 Alright, so we're making breakfast this morning. Breakfast for lunch because it's actually already noon. And Carly's putting some corned beef hash into a pan because everybody likes it's that. You're not eating it? Why? Because why? I'm a healthy diet. <laughs> she, she's in health class right now, so she's like all about reading labels for everything that she Our eats. Her health teacher told her going to die at age 20. Her health teacher told her if she keeps eating fast food, she's going to die before she's 20. Which we all know is not true. But anyways, not that fast food's good. I'm just saying, like, she's not going to die. All right, so, and then I'm cooking some eggs. Oh, and I need to make some toast. So, I have not touched my slime very long time. If you look at it, I have water in it. It's so cold. See, look, my mom said that we would have to throw it out in four days because it wouldn't be alive. It's like pure water and it's sticky and unusual. Do you remember playing with it? It feels completely different. Alright, so my friend is coming over. Her name is Joelle and. My room is a little messy, like always. So, I'm going to clean it. So, yeah. A lot of people ask me, like, why, like, every single time I have someone come over, it's a different person. Mostly because, um, I like meeting new people. But that never means that, like, let's use Lily for an example, because she comes over a lot. That does not mean that me and Lily are not friends anymore. Or let's just use, like, Lily and, like, she's only came over one time, but that, and she's never came over more than that, but that does not mean we're not friends. It just means that I like hanging out with other people too. I just like making new friends, but that means like if Lillian asked me to hang out, I would never like say no or anything. It just, I like hanging out with different people and meeting new people because it's fun. I dare you to go in the snow and make snow angels. Oh, let's do it. Wait, watch. Look at how cool this is. It just like melts in like a bath bomb. Like so. look, it melted. You're gonna have to go like to a bear spot though. Does it hurt? Are we really gonna do this? Oh, <laughs> you can't choose because this hurts your feet. What do you think it's gonna feel like on your body? That's so cold. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm, oh my god. I'm turning around. Oh my gosh, it's like packing snow on. Does it hurt? 
Nope. Nope. <laughs> okay, so we're going on the trampoline because my mom dared us to. No, I dared you to make snow angels. Um. Look at the smoke coming off your bodies. <laughs> What's gonna break? No, it, I, it won't. I don't think. I don't know. Well, it'll be pretty funny if it breaks. <laughs> Yeah. Oh my goodness. That's that one. Oh my gosh, look how big these cracks are. I know. I can't even like pick up the snow. Ouch. Jump, jump. It's so slippery. My feet are burning. Oh no. Wait, we have to lay down and Yeah, you try to go with your own footsteps. Just do a nasty plunge backwards. A plunge? Yeah, Into just the ice. Yep. <laughs> it's like, look, it, yeah, it's. Look, it's hard. It breaks. Oh. Like, see, watch. That's why it's like cutting us. Cause look, look it. It's like it comes off. It's, it's oh, off. It's I like see. This. Yeah. It's gonna hurt really bad. So then you just go like this. It's a frisbee. Ready? Two. <laughs> Be careful. Oh my god, it's stuck to me. It's stuck to your butt. <laughs> oh god. It's still stuck to my butt. What the heck? Oh, it's burning. It's not even hot anymore. Oh, my feet. Oh, my butt burns every time we touch it. Oh, it's so cold. Oh, that actually wasn't that bad. The only things that are cold is my toes. In my butt. In my butt, yeah. It burns. I'm sorry. Here, like, touch your butt. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, that's not weird, Carly. <laughs> <sighs> okay. We'll just make it quickly. You're going to do it again? Do you want to? Kind of fun. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. I love mine. <laughs> yeah, the gray one. I can't see. Right. It only hurts when you run through the snow because it like cracks. And it Why don't you just come out this way? And then you go like this. And then your butt will just melt it. Is that part icy? Yeah, it's icy, you can tell. Oh my butt! Do we have to stay in for 20 seconds? Okay, go. Go. One, two, <laughs> three, four, oh five, six, seven, ow! <laughs> are crazy hi guys so that's gonna be it for our video today as soon as chase and ken get home from wrestling practice i am going to finish wrapping some christmas presents with ken and probably watch a movie or something so i wanted to go ahead and have our video wrapped up for today thank you guys so much for watching please thumbs up our video if you enjoyed it which i hope you did 
Um, thank you for always coming back and watching our videos every day. It means a lot to us. And I hope you guys are having a good winter break so far. And I know some of you guys in the other side of the world are actually on summer break right now, which I'm super jealous. I wish we were on summer break instead. However, we live in the Midwest. We get all four seasons, which is really cool. So we just got to push through this winter weather and just cross our fingers that March gets here very, very quickly which I'm super excited because then April is the month that we're gonna be moving into our new house. So, um, question of the day is going to be, um, if you guys didn't notice, Carly has a new friend over today. Well, it's not really a new friend, but someone that has never come over to the house before. Her name is Joelle, she's super nice. And um, it just got me thinking about how sometimes you guys will comment about how Carly has so many different friends over all the time, like she must make her friends mad and they don't wanna come back or whatever, which that is not true. She's just kind of at a stage in her life where she's friends with a lot of different people. And um, I don't know, I think she's learning about friendships and learning about, like, I don't know, junior high is just like a tough time when it comes to friendships. Like you're kind of just, you're growing up, you're, you know, becoming a teenager, you're learning a lot about who you can trust and who you can't and who are your real friends and who aren't. And luckily Carly really hasn't had any drama when it comes to friendships here lately, but I really feel like over this next year or two, as she's entering into high school, she'll learn a lot more about like who her real friends are in terms of like, you know, best friends and really forming those bonds of friends that she'll probably have for the rest of her life. So anyways, question of the day is going to be, do you tend to have just like one or two best friends or do you tend to have a large group of friends and maybe not necessarily a best friend? Like where do you fall along that? Or you could be somewhere in the middle. Um, <clears throat> For me, I feel like as, as I've gotten older, I have less friends, but then the friends that I have, I know I can trust and count on them. Some of them I talk to all the time, some of them I don't talk to quite as often, but I know that we're there for each other and I miss those friends, but it's just different when you're older and you have so many things going on in your life and responsibilities and your family to take care of and that sort of thing that, uh, you know, sometimes you don't hang out or text or talk as much as you did, you know, when you were in your 20s. So anyways, yeah, that's the question of the day. Just wondered if you guys were kind of like Carly when it came to friendships or if you just, uh, you know, have just a handful of really close friends. So I don't know if that even makes sense. Just tell me about your friendships. How about that? So thanks guys for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. So Trends.